Astros hosting the Red Sox. The Red Sox are plus 112 on the money line. The Astros are minus 132. The over under eight and a half runs. The Red Sox getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 200, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And the Astros laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 164, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two runs or more. Now, weather will not be a factor because of the roof, the retractable, the dome, whatever you want to call it. Head to head, Pavetta did not pitch against the Astros last year or this year. And Blanco pitched once against the Red Sox this year. Four innings, three runs, two earned. They won 8-4 in Boston. He struck out five. Head-to-head, -head, the Astros are on a seven-game winning streak. They are 8-2 and two against the Red Sox in their last 10. The road team is 8-2. and two. The favorite is on a two-game winning streak. The underdog is 6-4 and four on the money line, and the underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is 7-3. and three. There have been two one-run games in their last 10. Tonight was one of them. The over is hitting their last two. The over is 8-2, and two, and the over 8.5 runs is 9-1. and one. The Red Sox are 2-3 and three in Pavetta's last five starts. Five innings pitched. 4.6 hits, 3.2 runs, three of which were earned, seven strikeouts, 0.8 walks, 1.6 home runs. He's given up home runs in four consecutive starts, and in all of those starts, he gave up two home runs per game. 87 pitches per game, 18.6 pitches per inning. For the Astros, three and two in Blanco's last five starts, five innings pitched, 4.2 hits, 2.6 runs, 2.4 of which were earned, six strikeouts per game, 1.8 walks per game, 0.6 home runs per game, 89.8 pitches per game, 18.5 pitches per inning. The Red Sox are on a two-game losing streak, 2-2 two two in their last four, 4-6 four in their last 10. 22 runs, 6 runs, 6 runs, 9 runs, 12 runs in a win, 5 runs in a win, 2 runs in a loss, and then 4 runs in a loss. For the Astros, they're on a three-game winning streak, 9-1 in their last 10. 9 runs, 7 runs, 2 runs, 9 runs. Four runs in a loss, six runs in a win, two runs in a win, and then five runs in a win. Astros with the money line. Astros laying the runs, and I am going to go over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.